After a broken leg ended his football career at the age of 10, Colton Brown began taking judo lessons to stay active, and now the Piscataway native is getting ready to compete in his second Olympic Games. News 12's Robin Dean has this great story. For Colton Brown, the countdown to his second Olympic Games is on. To do it once was incredible and to do it twice is just a great feeling. I've been so blessed to be able to do what I love at the highest level for such a long period of time. The Piscataway native had already qualified for the Olympic judo team in March of 2020, but the pandemic put his Tokyo dreams in jeopardy. This was a grueling process with COVID and everything, so this is going to be a very special Olympics for me. And I kind of know that this is this might be my last my last time out there, so it means even more. The 29 year old was able to requalify last month based on his world rankings and will now end his judo journey where it began. Brown went to train in Japan after graduating Piscataway High School in 2009. To go back to Japan and see some of my friends that I, I, I went through that experience with and to just, you know, to, to be there at the birthplace of judo and it's, it's special. This is where the first Olympics were in 1964 for judo. It was in this exact arena it's going to be in. Brown advanced to the round of 16 in his division at the Rio Games, but is hoping for a better result in Tokyo. He says his past Olympic experience will help him. The goal's always been a medal. I want to stand on the podium and it's doable. You know, like I've competed against all these guys that are in this division. And I know that, you know, if I have a day, uh, this is definitely doable. And I feel really good. I've had incredible training. Brown still trains in New Jersey and says the support he receives from the community will fuel him to be the best version of himself when he takes the stage in Tokyo. One thing I can say about Jersey and especially Piscataway, New Jersey, is the roots run deep and they genuinely want to see me do well. And that pushes, that forces me to, to go a little bit harder each day in training and as I prepare for these games. I'm Robin Dean for News 12 Sports. We do too. Good luck, Colton. Well, the Tokyo Summer Olympics begin on July 23rd.